Well, I mean, hey, they, they've been finding ways all year, and, and we've talked about it before. How, how it seems like every game, you know, we're fighting, um, you know, for for a playoff spot. And uh, tonight was obviously a little different. You know, we were we were fighting to kind of seal our fate. And uh, I thought it was great that some of these young guys that you know are, are getting an opportunity. Um, you know, not only just to play a game that doesn't mean anything, but it, to play a game that meant a whole lot. Well, I mean, listen, they're a young team, and, and this is a good league, and every night you got to be prepared and you got to be ready. And, um, you know, in a way, I thought we, we scored early, and I think sometimes when we do that, we think it's going to be an easy game. And, um, you know, it took us a little while to settle back in. But, uh, you know, we found ways like we have in the past, and, again, you know, pretty proud of their effort. Well, I mean, you know, obviously we generate a lot of offense. So on any given night, you know, guys can guys can step up. Certainly, it was nice to see McCallum and you know Connie get on the board. And Yearwood's been you know a great uh, addition to our team. You know, him and Coglin at the at the deadline, just two competitive guys. And then, you know, obviously inserting the D into the lineup. Uh, you know, I think tonight was a really you know a, a good. Um, uh, learning experience for them you know there was times where they did get caught but there was times where they really dug in and, and battled as well so overall I was pretty happy with everyone yeah yeah and, and you know it's going to happen in these games there's obviously ebbs and flows and there was times where we felt like we were pulling away a little bit and then they pushed back so uh, again you know I thought going into the third period we talked about just shutting them down we didn't we didn't need you know to make any birdies or eagles it was just uh, you know par some holes on the back stretch and, and come up with a win yeah, Woody's actually got, you know, a real quiet confidence to him and, and some poise. And, um, you know, when we lost Larmy and a couple guys that are normally on the power play, I thought it was a good opportunity for him to step in. And, and he's done well. And, I mean, you know, again, he's a guy that doesn't have a ton of experience in this league, so he's trying to fast track and catch up and learn on the fly. And I thought he's done a really good job to this point. Uh, we just made the playoffs, and no one asked me about it. So I'll go ahead and congratulate the guys and say that uh, this was a long time coming, and uh, they, they grinded really hard, and, and uh, I leaned on them hard, and I asked them to do a lot, and, and they've responded every time. And, uh, you know, the city deserves it, and these guys deserve it, and, and I'm happy for them. And now we'll move on and set our sights on whatever's next. Uh, it wasn't as clean as a win as we wanted, but uh, two points are two points, and we've made the playoffs, which is a goal of ours. Uh, we just same as always. Keep it simple. Outwork them. We, we couldn't take them lightly, and uh, we got the win. Um, it's it's been an honor. Uh, I've been uh, I believed in this team since I got here, and uh, we've clinched playoffs. Which I believe when I got here we were out of playoffs, and that was a goal of uh, Dmax. So I'm, I'm proud of us. Uh, I try and bring physicality. I just want to be a player that you don't want to play against. Just hard work. Uh, I haven't played in the playoffs in this league, and I'm excited. We're we're ready to go to war. I love this. The, the fans in this team, you know, they get loud and I'm excited for playoffs because I feel like they're going to get even louder.